Good morning, Los Angeles. We all know Blake Griffin can dunk over a car, but I think today, Clipper fans would be happy if he was just a little more grounded. Hi, I'm Bill Plasky, sports columnist, Los Angeles Times, and this is your wake-up call. A familiar wake-up indeed for Clipper fans on Thursday night in Chicago. Midway through the third quarter of a game between the Clippers and the Chicago Bulls, Blake Griffin, while defending Taj Gibson, while trying to slap the ball, instead slapped Gibson in the head, knocked him down, flagrant two foul, ejected from the game. At the time, after Gibson's free throws, the Clippers were down 16 points. They came back, nearly pulled it off, lost 83 to 80. It's a stirring comeback, but it happened with Griffin in the locker room. And that's happened too much with Griffin not into the game, being assessed technical fouls. He leads the league with seven technicals. He leads the league with two ejections. And again, was it a flagrant two foul? Well, officials initially called it a flagrant one foul. They looked at the replay and called it a flagrant two. The reason is Griffin's hand came across outstretched, hit the head of Gibson. And the difference between a flagrant two and a flagrant one is the word unsportsmanlike. Was it an unsportsmanlike act? Griffin didn't mean it. Clearly didn't mean it. But just as clearly, the officials, anytime that arm is outstretched, that hand's outstretched, and that hand hits the face in a punching motion, they have to make that call. They have no choice. And Blake Griffin now has no choice but to chill out. Chill out on the technical fouls. Chill out on going overboard with the officials. You think the officials were maybe laying in wait for him a little bit? Of course they were. They look at game film just like the players do. Even though they, this was done by a replay, you have to know in the back of their mind, this was Blake Griffin. And in the back of their mind, they've seen this too many times before. Blake Griffin needs to chill out for the Clippers to get in the kind of playoff position where they have any chance at all in the Western Conference. You can reach us at latimes.com. Follow me on Twitter at Bill Plaschke. Have a great day.